All right, guys, so here it is. This is the RV we rented. It's about five meters long, has bunk beds. Obviously, it drives on the right side. A bit old. We just gonna sleep up here, these are down here. We have a small refrigerator. That's the toilet, we're not gonna use it. We're gonna try to use the rest stops as much as we can. We got a tiny kitchenette. They let us borrow a stove. We got a bunch of storage. Beds up there, table, chairs. Vas a dormir sola? Sí. Okay. Si te quieres dormir sola, puedes dormir ahí, okay? All right, so we started. We went and grabbed some coffee, and now we're gonna go to the B by Art Museum. It's like a field of uh, art statues. That's next. quick change of plans uh, it turns out that because it's Tuesday the place that we were going to the museum was closed so we came to a different museum which is on the way to a winery guys so this town's a dud and uh be a fellow sleep so we're gonna try a rest stop it's supposed to be like the first rest stop in hokkaido so we're gonna try to go over there and buy some groceries it seems like they have the uh, local uh, produce there so we're gonna try to go buy some stuff there this is our first rest stop this is Mikasa rest stop. They have some uh, yakitori right there that looks really good. And then behind me, some kind of uh, another food truck. But we're looking for the groceries. They have produce here, so we'll hopefully we can buy some cheap groceries. They can't share one though. Too big. They can share. Keto food. Non keto food. That's ten dollars worth of groceries. Mm -hmm. Wow. This is really good. Alright, so I just got my addiction. It's about a dollar seventy-five, uh dollar sixty somewhere in there for ice large iced coffee. This is large. I got about five creams in there. It's really good. Hey guys, so we came to a winery because Megu loves wine and this is basically a, like Hokkaido's wine country. I don't drink, plus I can't drink even if I wanted to because I'm not driving. Uh, but we might check it out, see if they have samples and then Megu might buy a, a bottle or two or three or four or five. It's como mountain. Like a mountain. Look, 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 look. Ria, agarra la mano a Risa porque se la va a llevar esa águila. Agarrele la mano para que no se le lleve esa águila.
like it started raining on us so we went to try to find the um, auto camping place but it's closed, so we just found an onsen and we're just gonna take a bath and go back in. All right, so that onsen felt really good, really, really good. But it was kind of awkward though, because one, everybody was naked. Two, I got into the hot water and there was three, three guys in there. And slowly, not immediately, but slowly, each one of them left and went outside. So I don't know if they just wanted to hit the inside one, hit the outside one and leave, because one of them actually left around the same time as me or if they just were uncomfortable with me in there, I don't know. But I made it real quick, so I gotta cook dinner for everybody. They're still in there. And uh, yeah, it looks like we're gonna spend the night here because of the uh, the place that we were supposed to stay is not open, it's seasonal. And then the other place, we had to make reservations and we didn't, so so that's okay. Parking lot, it is. And then uh, we didn't see any signs that said you couldn't sleep overnight. So we're just gonna cook something and then stay here. What's this place called? Chipubetsu. Hey guys, so we finally ended up in uh, Chipubetsu or something like that. Uh, they have a rest stop here with Wi-Fi and bathrooms and uh, it's just because where we were at, it was a little kind of country, so there was no internet, uh, even the uh, 3G, the slow 3G that we get. So we came over here, we're going to go to the convenience store, grab some stuff. Our our cooking top is not working the one that belongs to Megu's dad so we're gonna see if we can replace that one and uh, and then maybe cook something if not then we just make a salad and relax so yeah it's a interesting day for sure I viene carro Morning guys, it's day two of our road trip in Hokkaido and uh, we woke up at a rest stop. We're thinking everything's still closed. It's like six o'clock in the morning. So we're gonna take a drive to a nearby attraction and then we might dr drive through here again or just go straight to the coast. So, um, Papa, yes, that's yeah. in the boil. That's so sad. ¿Se te atoró la mano ahí? ¿De qué te ríes, Isa? ¿Por qué te estás riendo? No te ríes de tu pobre hermana. Hey guys, it looks like the sun's getting ready to come out. It's about 8.20 in the morning on day two. We're on our way to the coast. We're gonna check out some restaurants, some of the capes over there. And uh, yeah, it's a new day. Thank you for watching guys remember i'm on a mission to retire early and travel the world with my family so on top of my weekly vlogs i'm also going to put videos on how i plan to generate money on the road how i save money how i become a minimalist and anything that helps me reach that goal of early retirement uh, if that's something that interests you please subscribe to this channel click right here to see the latest upload click here to see videos that relate to this video right here don't forget to hit the little bell so you can get notifications for whenever i upload new videos and also if you like this video please hit the like button thank you for watching and i'll see you guys on the next one bye